Goblin just left Pine Park, and in this video, I'm gonna be talking about it. But first, if you're new around here, give me a sub. Goblin just dropped a bombshell in the community. He left Pine Park. I don't think anyone saw this coming. I know I didn't, and probably the only people who did were the people behind the scenes. So yesterday, Monday night, Goblin would drop a tweet saying, Effective today, I will no longer be part of Pine Park and the Gobcast will be moving to its own YouTube channel. I will not be attending the August meetup, nor will I be in any future episodes of Pine Park After Dark. We have about four more Gobcast episodes from the Pine Park studio before we move sets. I enjoy my time at Pine Park. However, creative, business, and personal differences made it impossible to continue my time there. There may be a small downtime between my Gobcast episodes, during the move to our new set, but I'm confident you'll be very happy with the new changes. All questions can be directed to Pine Park. So after a tweet like that, everyone in the community was going crazy. Asking questions like, why? What happened? Are you still cool with Tim and Eric? Who was in the wrong? But I don't think it was as simple as who was in the wrong. Because an hour after that tweet, Eric Khan would tweet out saying, wish we could have come to an agreement but Goblin and Pine Park have parted ways over the weekend. Sorry there's no drama. Him and I are still friends and gonna smoke and chill. Just a disagreement and pass for the future. We still got plans for FUMO though. I see Pine Park bigger than myself. I know this shit's gonna take over the world. Five states in and we aren't stopping soon. I got no problem investing my time, energy, even my money into it. Goblin is on a different grind right now. But I know he's gonna kill it with whatever he's doing next and I'm going to support it 110%. So I'm glad this whole business disagreement thing didn't come between the two because obviously Goblin and Eric Khan, Tim, those, that trio is perfect. So I wouldn't want to see, you know, business getting between them being friends. So that's cool to see. But obviously, there's still the question out there, what happened? Because through all these tweets, they don't really say what happened. You know, they, they say it's a business uh, disagreement, but they don't really, you know, say 100% what it was. And if I had to, you know, suggest any reason why this happened, it would be something to do with revenue in the Gobcast. Because I'm assuming Pine Park is probably getting the revenue for the Gobcast because they're doing all the equipment and it's on their YouTube channel. So, you know, I could probably see that being the reason. But I don't know 100%, so take that with a grain of salt. But even after hearing everything is cool between Eric and Goblin and Tim, I'm still surprised and shocked by all this information because, like, it just came out. Like, I'm recording this video a few hours after it happened, and I'm posting the video the day after, so I'm still processing all this information. Like, it, it's crazy. I want to hear what you have to think about this whole thing going on. And until next time, peace. She said I can have it. 2016, little bitch, I'm a savage. Johnny Depp, sue a bitch, make all the baggage. Then I feel like a motherfucking bandit. R.I.P. Juice, I got breaks in the cabinet. Sold them off on my search and